For the last three seasons, four-star wide receiver Amon Day has been one of the most consistent players in all the high school football. He's a wide receiver for Lowndes High School in Valdosta, Georgia. And even though no one's ever claimed him to be a five-star recruit or an elite physical specimen, but he has some elite traits that wide receivers need. He's a very good route runner. He has elite body control. He has elite hands. And he has a huge catch radius. Last week, he was featured on the top plays in high school football. Right here is one of my favorite catches of the weekend. Four-star wide receiver Amon Day scooping the ball up off of the ground. Day is one of my favorite players in the nation. Not gonna wow you with his speed, but he has some of the best hands and best body control out of anybody in high school football. I've seen him week after week make catches like this time and time again. In today's high school football matchup, Day and his Lounge High School Vikings are going up against one of the most talented teams in all of Florida, American Heritage School in Plantation, Florida, Broward County. Amon was so excited to play in this game today, he couldn't even focus in class. The only thing that he can think about is making big plays on this Friday night. The most impressive thing about Amon Day, in my opinion, is how he's able to fit all of that hair under his helmet and not have any hair show. This man is doing a voodoo trick. Heritage Patriots, Lounge Vikings, Florida versus Georgia. Huge matchup today, and I can't wait for it to go down. Amon Day is who our eyes should be on this game. Glued to the screen for him. Now I know there's going to be some other talented players on the football field on both sides of the ball. But we're here for Amon Day. Let that be known. First play of the game, they would send Day in motion. Have him at the slot right here. He would get man coverage. Ends up getting separation from his man. And it's a first down conversion on third down and nine. 19 yard reception on the play. They're around midfield, Amon Day gets man coverage, runs an incredible out route on the play. Nice catch. I don't know why he fell though, but this out route right here shows the tremendous stop start ability. He had that corner lost. Third down and three, audible at the line of scrimmage. Amon Day gets the ball on a slant. Lounds up 7-0. Your typical Amon Day play for 15 yards. Such a chain mover, and he has the ability to still make the big plays. Kyson Ray, nice throw right here. Third down and four. Amon Day across the middle. That should have been picked off, but he still catches the rock. The awareness of number 17 to make a play like that. Quarterback throws a bad pass, and you still catch the rock. He is special. After this play, Amon Day really wouldn't have that much action for the rest of the game. Well, not until the fourth quarter, where the score would be 28 to 20. Heritage up on him. Fourth quarter, Lowndes has the ball. They give it the day on the screen, and he will be stopped short, forcing the third down and three. Down by 15, they need to hurry up and score. Moving the ball down the field, still down by 15. Day, get a man coverage. Nice dig route to the middle, and that's a touchdown. 26-35. Lowndes would go for two, and they would actually convert. The defense would get a stop, and Lowndes would still have a chance to win this ball game. 33 seconds left to go in the game. Fourth down and six. Amon Day running the dig. Middle of the field. Catches the rock. Stays on his feet and got a little bit more yardage. We got to see the replay. Because it just glitched out for a second. Amon Day doing the unthinkable. Double coverage. He snatches the rock. Stays on his feet. Got a little bit more. If he was just a tad bit faster, he might have been 88 and out the gate getting into the end zone. Still a huge play on this drive. 
Second down and 10. 20 seconds left to go. Down by 7. Day. C-zone coverage. Gave it to him on the out route. First down and 10. 15 seconds left to go. They need to get back on the ball. Man coverage. Day beats this man. Miscommunication from him and the quarterback. Such a missed opportunity right here. The coach would take Day out the game, so the quarterback throws it to the end zone and is picked off. Lounge will take the L. Amon Day basically carried this team the entire fourth quarter, and for some reason, the team could not hold up their end of the bargain. The one play they take this man out the game, the quarterback throws the interception. That's crazy. He had 144 yards of offense today. Still could not get the job done. Florida ends up beating Georgia in this matchup. Cassius be him, player of the game. Subscriber to the channel with eight catches, 155 yards, and two receiving touchdowns. Heritage wins 35-28 over Lowndes. Heritage moves on, and they're now 3-1 while Lowndes is 1-2, losing record. Amon Day, 11 catches, 144 receiving yards. And some other guys were getting off as well. Kyson Ray, 306 passing yards, but he threw two picks. 75% completion percentage in this game. And if you're new to this channel, anybody with a period next to their name means that they are a subscriber to the channel. Anybody with an apostrophe next to their name means that they are a Patreon member. But Amon Day's actually a Patreon member. He just originally submitted a form as a subscriber to the channel. But now, I'm going to have to make that change from period to apostrophe. This game is sponsored by the Reason Sports Universe. So, if you want to be a character on this channel, then make sure you watch this video right here. You can be a character in the Reason Sports Network universe. We make content for high school, college, and the pros. You can submit a form. The link will be in the description. However, if you sign up with Patreon, you'll have a lot more customization and control over your character. The link will be in the description. You can also view your player season and career stats online. The link will be in the description. I also added a social media feature for the universe to be more immersive. The link to that video will also be in the description. If you don't have Patreon, but you still want to be featured on the channel more, then make sure you're active in the comment section. You being consistently active reminds me to put you on the channel in some way. When you submit a form, your character will be put in the universe. You can see yourself in a live stream or video when teams play, but it's highly unlikely that you'll see me controlling your player throughout a game if you don't have Patreon. Signing up with Patreon gives you control over attributes, accessories, gives you a GTA face, control over your backstory, and you'll be one of the best players in the universe. But anyways, it's Reezy, owner of the Reason Sports Network. Make sure y'all like the video. Make sure y'all comment on the video. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. And make sure you click on the post notification bell too. If you want to see the craziest ending in high school football history, then click this video right here. Or you can subscribe to the YouTube channel or you can subscribe to the Patreon.